like a trip away So I pray every morning, I don't never skip a day My life a movie, to be honest, I'm a clip away Want the water on my diamonds, I'm a drip away Any It's your girl, Taylor Lachelle, back at it again with another video. If you are new, I am Taylor Lachelle, clearly. And if you are not new, welcome back to my channel. I decided to do a little Ulta haul because I went to Ulta today and spent $200. $200. So, I'm going to show y'all what I got. Some of this stuff is TikTok finds. Some of this stuff is just stuff that I was like, I got to have it or I got to try it. So, I'm just going to show y'all. And I know I look rough. I look really crusty, dusty, and tired because I definitely am all of those. Definitely tired. But let me just show y'all. Here's my receipt. Oh, it was just $2.19. That's still a lot. So, mm. let's just start. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out the bag. So, the first thing I got is this Crest 3D White Noticeably White White Strips. Um... It's supposed to whiten your teeth in just a few days. That's what the box say. So I got this. This was like $21, I think. And there's 20 strips in here. 10 treatments. I saw this on TikTok, so honestly, I was like, let me try it. Because the girl teeth was white. Believe it or not, some of y'all be downplaying TikTok a lot. Saying it's trash and this, this, and this. But you really learn a lot on TikTok. I've learned so many hacks, beauty hacks, life hacks. Mm, you learn a lot on TikTok. Ever since TikTok and quarantine, y'all, I have been a like body care fanatic. Like any body care product that people rave about on TikTok or hygiene product, I'm just like, ooh, I gotta get it. I gotta try it. Cause I don't know. I think TikTok just did that to me. But okay, next. So the next thing I got is I didn't See this from TikTok. I actually got the lotion. I mean, what is it called? I actually got the shower gel, the body wash in this um brand. This is Shea Moisture, African, like Jamaican African soap, whatever it's called. I got the shower gel. Phenomenal. Absolutely love it, y'all. I see a difference in my skin already. Um, I have very sensitive very dry chronically dry skin that shower gel has did a 360 on my skin my skin is moisturized now it's soft i got a smooth even tone i love that soap i can rave about that soap all day that soap and a dr broner soap and two soaps right there i feel like everybody need <laughs> so i got the lotion just to see you know because i got the shower gel might as well get the lotion so i got the lotion that soap was like eleven dollars make i mean why do you call that soap the lotion was ten dollars so this is my first time ever using shea moisture's body care i mean i used the african black soap facial bar and it burnt my skin off this was like some years ago but the body care i've never tried because after the face soap i said no nah, never again but it actually worked out pretty good got this papaya and vitamin c body bar I'm gonna use this in the shower tonight because mm, if y'all want to see like a body care, pamper routine, shower routine, let me know in the comments. I'll do it too. But yeah, so I got this. And honestly, this is a big bar. I feel like it's very inexpensive for how big it is. Let me see. Shea Moisture, that was $5.82. Um, actually, I have rewards, so the prices may be off just a little bit. So the next thing I got is this booty drops firming body oil so it has caffeine in it and it's for a butt forklift y'all know me in person my booty is flat as a pancake okay it's just now starting to get a little life to it after all these years of living i decided to get this because i'm about to start working out probably start lifting per tire and said we about to start working out so told Jamani she need to come on jump on the train too we can all make this a best friend thing work out I give me a booty give me some muscle but I got this for that so then when I start working out I can put this so my skin is nice and firm all right I honestly don't know why I got this but just know I got it I think this was like $16 what a shame $17.73 let me see this. I didn't even open this in the store. So this is by Frank Body. 
Hey, it's kind of cute. So this is what it looks like. Let's take a swift. Do it smell like coffee? I don't know. I don't think it has a smell. But I'm gonna update y'all on this too. All right. What? Next, I got, I don't even know how to pronounce this. Naiva, Naivia, 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 I don't know. Um, it's just a regular body lotion, skin firming, hydration. I read the reviews on this, a whole bunch of good reviews. So I was like, wow. Let me try this lotion, see if it really works. It smell like a regular body lotion, honestly. I love the way this smells. It smells like childhood. Um, that lotion was $10 too, I think. The next thing I got is this Fab Girl Six Pack by Bliss. So I've actually used this in the past and I really liked it. It's really just a caffeinated gel that you put on your stomach pre-workout and it's supposed to firm, help you like achieve the look of a six pack and stuff like that. And it does work. I've used this a few times. I haven't used a new formula though. I used to use the old formula online, the reviews. I saw a lot of people saying that the old formula was way better than the new formula. So we gonna see, but this was $24. So it better be good. Next, I just got this keychain. Definitely didn't need this, but I got it because it was $3. And I always use these keychains until they break. I always get these from Ulta. The one I have, it's not broken, but it's definitely dirty and dingy, so I just got another one because it was just $3. All right, then I also got this papaya and vitamin C. This papaya and vitamin C um, lip balm, the same as the, what do you call that? Soap bar. This was $3 too, I think. Mm. I already got hecka lip gloss on. Ooh, she thick. We're going to see if this bright my lips. Brighter Days Ahead Lip Balm. That's what it's called by Shea Moisture. Go get you some. Very thick and very moisturizing. Love it already. Alright, so next. Aftershave. Wait, aftershave. No, I'm tired. Aftershave gel with lidocaine. Okay, so the rest of the stuff I got is beauty products. I got a new foundation and a new concealer. These are the Urban Decay Weightless Liquid Foundation and this one is the Stay Naked Correcting Concealer. So I got 60 CG and 40 NY. I wonder what, I see this is the only stupid part. This is what it looks like. So pretty. About not being able to have testers at Ulta right now is really killing me. Oh, that's not too bad. Wait, hold up. What even is this? It really is weightless. So, I guess it is a good shade because... Hmm. This hand has the foundation. This hand does not. So, I got this one. It looks so ashy. I don't know. I'm going to try it. I'm probably going to try this tomorrow and give it a little swirly-whirly. The next thing I got is this Anastasia um brow duo powder my eyebrows are really really light and i'm tired of my eyebrows having to draw my eyebrows on super dark i want them to match like what they look like almost without it so i'm gonna try this if that made any sense so this one is the brow powder duo anastasia i got soft brown next thing i got from there is this morphe and morphe 167 brush this is a eyeshadow brush but i'm going to use this for concealer because i need another concealer brush let me show y'all this tip on it is nice and thick she thick yeah i'm going to use this for concealer because it's just a really soft brush and it's angled and it's already like flat so that helps a lot with concealer and like trying to carve out stuff and all that. So yeah, got this brush. Hooray, that was my Ulta haul. It wasn't really nothing y'all. I spent all this money. I feel like most of them, most of it came from this product, these products right here. Most of the cost came from these things because this was 18, darn near. This was 18, no, this was 23 or 18, one of them. 
This one was 39. I believe this one was 29. This one's 24. This one's 21. So yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to go back to Ulta tomorrow to find my right shade in this concealer because um I don't know, Shawty. It might look crazy on me. Yeah, that's all that stuff. Let me put it back in my bag. I also went to Kohl's. I'm gonna show y'all what I got. First things first, I got this hoodie. Cause Hoodie season is upon us. It is getting chilly outside. I'm so happy summer is over. I'm so happy summer's over. I'll be happy when winter gets here. But for now, we're kicking it in the fall. And I got this champion hoodie. It was like, I don't even know. I'm so tired. Let's see, how much did I pay for this hoodie? So I paid $33.99 for this hoodie. I got... Three more body care products. I got this soothing aloe vera gel, this exfoliating wash towel. Um, I have the exfoliating wash gloves, wash mitts, but they a little dingy now, so I decided to try out the towel. We're gonna see how this one works. I'm in the rag. This is a rag. Wait, what? Whatever. I'm gonna I'm try this out. This one was $8. Oh, that's why I went to Kohl's. I went to Kohl's because these things were on sale there. And they're not on sale at Ulta. So, this was $6, I believe. And at Ulta, it's like 8 This one was $10 at Kohl's. It is $15 at Ulta. So, I went to Kohl's to get it. Um, And then, I just got this tea tree moisturizing foot oil. Because, you know, I got to keep toes pretty it's about to be cold so my toes about to be tucked away i want to make sure they don't get crusty it's supposed to soften hard skin and calluses soothes and revitalizes tired feet tea tree moisturizing foot oil oh, okay so you can also spray this on your knees your elbows your hands and other dry skin areas well, this one was five dollars let me see what else for these. Okay, this is the last thing I got from there. I got this candle. This can I got this candle. This candle was $12.75. A little nasty. But this is the Scentworks Cashmere Pumpkin. I just wanted to add a little extra oomph and fall to my room. So dang. Let me show y'all my pillow. got this from at home um because i was gonna decorate my room and fall decor i still might i don't know should i if i should comment down below that i should or should not i love fall i love fall y'all i love everything about fall i love the weather i love the food i love the attire everything the holidays and then also love winter too winter is my favorite my birthday's in winter at this point i'm just talking but let me just talk so I was gonna decorate my room and fall decor and I have no fall decor. This is the only thing I have. So I got this pumpkin candle and I plan to get some more stuff to kind of spice my room up a bit. So yeah, that's my haul guys. Hmm. Anything you guys want to see me do, any videos you want to see me do next, leave them down in the comment section below. If you haven't checked out my two recent videos, they're gonna be right here, so go watch them. I have two different hair videos up. I have a curly hair video and I have a straight hair video um, on how I achieved this look. I cut my hair and went from curly to straight. And then my curly hair video was a sponsored video, so y'all definitely go check that out because mm, mm, mm. don't forget to like this video, comment down below any videos you want to see me do next, and hit that ding bell so you get notified every time I post a video or occasionally get notified when I post videos so that way you won't miss a thing. Follow me on my social medias. It's Taylor Shell on everything. Peace, y'all. Was temporary like everything in life i'm never satisfied i want everything in life i gamble with my thoughts